Harold Saw Gogger Bolt Pro was a member of the 1954 graduating class of Oshkosh High School. In football, he was a letter winner in 1952 and 1953. In basketball, he was a letter winner in 1953 and 1954, and he was team captain in 1954. In baseball, Harold was a letter winner in 1952, 1953, and 1954. He averaged 15 strikeouts per nine innings and threw five no-hitters in 1954. He was a member of the 1954 Wisconsin State Championship team where he combined with Howie Coplitz to throw a no-hitter in the 3 to nothing championship game victory over Kenosha. Harold is also a member of longtime Oshkosh coach Harlan Quant's all-time baseball team. Harold was the American Legion team's leading pitcher in 1953 and 1954, and he was a member of the American Legion Wisconsin State Championship, Regional Championship, and Sectional Final Team of 1954. Harold was the American Legion Athletic Award winner in 1954. Harold continued his baseball career as a member of the Detroit Tigers when he signed with them in August of 1954. Tragically, his life and career were cut short when he was killed in an automobile accident on October 5, 1954. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure to present Harold Saw Gauger, Class of 2008, and accepting the award on Harold's behalf is his brother, Larry Gauger.
team from Oshkosh to both the state and the national and regional tournaments and won championship in both of those. In 1954, he led his Oshkosh High School baseball team the WIA State Tournament Championship. After graduating in 1954, he signed a professional baseball contract with the Detroit Tigers of the American League as one of their top prospects. Unfortunately, he never had the opportunity to begin his professional career because he was killed in an automobile accident. I truly believe that we might not be here today if that accident hadn't occurred. If that accident never happened, I think we would have been here three or four years ago, honoring Harry as the next Major League Baseball player to graduate from Oshkosh High School. So Harry, congratulations. It took a while, but you finally are recognized for your talents and your hard work. And once again, I'd like to thank the selection committee and also express my congratulations to the other honorees tonight. Uh, if you can put up with the next fellow, he just has a few words to say, but he usually ends up saying more than that. So <laughs> be patient with him. Oh, Jim Foose. Thank you. 